So I'm out here in the shed building, the new creamery, and we're noticing this funky smell in here every time we're having class and every time I'm here milking the cow. Basically every day, not just Friday farm school, but the smell is coming from underneath the building. So apparently what's happening is um, I drew this whole property map for the kids in farm school the other day. So here's the house and if the septic tank, which it is right here in the backyard, apparently these leech lines go something like this um, some way or another. I don't know. I know there's, they said there's some lines going between the house. But the septic lines are definitely running this way, downhill, and going underneath this building. One of them is like going directly down the center. And what's happening is underneath here, this is the creamery. Right underneath here, there's this water just bursting out of the ground, sewage water. And it's just flowing out into the backyard. And it, it's going different directions but the whole yard back here where we want our baby area to be um on this side of it there's just sewage it's just wet with sewage and nasty so i've got to fix that today and see how we're going to take care of that or runs down out of there and into this backyard area which is just completely disgusting it stinks I don't know who would end the leech line there and let it just run out under the building. It's just disgusting. I'm not sure how leech lines are built or how they're made, but we're going to divert it using this pipe. And so I've got the pipe going in and we're going to figure out how to get that water to go into this pipe and leave out into the field further out that way into the pasture. All right, so water flow is coming from this back corner you see the water right there moving obviously I don't know if you can tell but the water's moving back here out of the ground going this direction so obviously I'm thinking there should be then a pipe if I dig here past that I'm gonna dig and see if we can't locate a pipe I've dug in two places and not found the pipe, just found more water coming from the earth. Sewage water. So, what I'm going to do is fill that hole back in. It's going up over this piece of uh, concrete that's holding this support beam. It's flowing over that and going down into the backyard. So, I am going to cut away this section right here dig away and I'm gonna put my pipe in there and it'll be lower than the concrete inshallah so that way um, it'll just flow through the pipe I decided to fill in the puddle use my skills as a kid plan up plan outside with mud puddles and waterways making creek ways diverting creek ways so I've diverted the water, I built up a dam with the clay from over here on this side of the building. I packed that clay pretty good, made a dam wall. So when this water fills out of that hole, and most of the hole is filled in, but it's, you know, the water's going to come. It is going across the top of this concrete like it's been doing, running down. I dug deep here, I put that pipe in. Stuck a piece of granite there to, to some of the water was flowing against the back of that pipe and going into the ground here and still down. And some of it still will do that. Water will find a way. But with that, I found with that piece there, it disturbs it and makes it kind of go along the piece and down into the pipe. So most of it is going into that pipe. That pipe is going to go out to the field. I got to stretch it on out. But the flow of the water that's underneath it has slowed down to a standstill. So uh, once we now need to cover, I think what I'll do is cut this plastic that I'm laying on. I'll cut it to cover this up. I'll put a brick on it over there on that side. 
I'll cover the hole, put a brick over here, over there to cover the hole, and hopefully that'll keep the smell down. And I'll stuff that plastic real good around this pipe and put dirt on it, and hopefully we'll see if that doesn't work to keep the smell down. So I'm going to cut everything. I have to take my glove off to get my phone. It's pretty nasty under here. It stinks so bad. But hopefully this will solve our problem outside. Okay, I've covered it with the plastic. Use rocks and mud to hold it down. It's covered over that way. Hopefully this will take care of our bad smell in the building. So we're gonna straighten out the pipe out here. Oh God, this is a bad, dirty job, but somebody had to do it. How do you know you love the farm? When you're willing to get in the sewage. Lord have mercy. And now you can see the water's coming out the way it's supposed to. Hopefully that lasts and shawl off.